Scary wake up call when it comes to airport security. The airline employee who stole and crashed a plane, leaving behind a blueprint of significant flaws in air travel safety. It's also raising the question tonight. How easy is it to actually fly a plane? Is it as simple as playing one of those video games, those simulators? Team 12's William Pitts is out at Sky Harbor to verify it for us tonight. Airline pilots go to school for a long time to learn how to fly one of these jets. So can someone really learn how to pilot a plane just from their computer? That's what Richard Russell said when he stole this plane, a de Havilland Dash 8. It's a passenger plane used for shorter hops. He claimed he learned to fly with video games. Actually, you can. It's going to take you a little bit of time, but uh, you can, if you put the time into it, you can learn how to fly very easily on a flight simulator. Now, will you be good at it in an actual airplane? Probably not. Professor Ed Coleman at Embry-Riddle Aeronautical University in Prescott says flight simulators are so advanced you can learn way more than the basics. For about 70 bucks, you can buy a flight simulator program for your computer and you can buy a plug-in to fly a Dash 8. Now this is the actual cockpit and this is the computer simulation virtually identical. There's no substitute for hands-on flying, but Coleman says there's help there too. But like everything else in the airline industry or in the aviation industry in particular, there's a checklist for that. So you can download the checklists online. Some of the flight simulator programs come with them. Most companies actually leave the checklist in the airplane. He's right. In less than a second, we found a checklist online for the Dash 8 showing exactly what switches to push or pull to take off, fly and land. And on YouTube, the electrical panel looks like it's all good. Entire videos walking you through the startup procedure. You unhinge it and then press it in. Still, that's a simulator on the ground. To actually get airborne and fly the airplane like he did, very surprised. That's that shows a level of skill or practice that not the average person would have. So we can verify, yes, you probably can learn to fly a plane with just a computer program, just not that well. But Russell oh apparently didn't care if he made it down right safely. Now. William Pitts, 12 News.